Stars will have collected different amounts of gas, so are different sizes. There are two main paths the life of a star can next take. If the star is less than four times the mass of the Sun, it is a low mass or small star. Towards the end of the star's life, it begins to run out of hydrogen and fuel to fuse together, so nuclear fusion in the core stops. This means that there is no longer anything generating an outward pressure to counteract the gravitational inward pull. This makes the outer layers of the star begin to collapse inwards again. As before, this makes the temperature and pressure increase. The temporary heat creates outward pressure again and counteracts the inward force of gravity, pushing the outer layers of the star outwards. The star ends up expanding much more than it did before, and it becomes about a hundred times bigger than it's ever been in its life. It has turned into a red giant. While the outer layers of the red giant continue to expand, the core is still contracting, so the temperature continues to increase. The temperature gets high enough for helium fusion to begin, so that an even heavier element, carbon, forms. This process may take as little as a few minutes for a star similar in size to the Sun. No further fusion takes place, as there is not enough in mass to compress the carbon further to fuse together. The core remains stabilised. Large amounts of matter are ejected from the outer layers of the red giant, until only about 20% of the star's initial mass remains. The star then begins to cool, and shrinks until the gravitational pull is balanced by the repulsion of the electrons at the core. It stops shrinking and becomes a white dwarf, which is about half as massive as the Sun, but only slightly bigger than the Earth, so is one of the densest materials in the universe. As it can't produce any more heat, it radiates away the remaining heat for billions of years. Once the heat is all gone, it sits as a cold, dark mass called a black dwarf. A more massive main-sequence star can take another path, whose end result is a bit more exciting.